today's video, I bought tons of Five Nights at Freddy's products that you had no idea existed. And then I unboxed, destroyed, and give them away at the end of this video. So let's get right into it. So let's see the first forgotten FNAF item we have. Ugh. Move out of the way, Shadow Freddy. Ugh. Let's unbox this. What the heck? Now FNAF bootleg, oh my, they ruined the videos. Bootlegs always ruin the videos. How did this guy get in here? This isn't forgotten. This is just trash. And we gotta go take out the trash. Let's go destroy this guy. Oh man, these stupid bootlegs are always ruining the video. Oh, I know what Mr. Hammer thinks. Oh, Jordan, what do you think? Yeah, Jordan, I really agree. And the only way to deal with these dumb bootlegs is with Mr. Hammer, who hates the bootlegs. Wait. They always ruin the videos. All right, let's go review some actual Five Minutes of Freddy's merch. Oh man, those darn bootlegs are always ruining the videos. Let's get into some actual merchandise. Oh, this is a big one. Shadow Freddy, move it, buddy. It's time to unbox this bad boy. So the next Forgotten FNAF merch that you guys probably didn't know existed are official Five Nights at Freddy's pillow pets. And now some people know these exist. Don't worry, the really obscure stuff is at the end of the video. But I think it's crazy that we got official Five Nights at Freddy's pillow pets. Now everyone knows about the bootleg ones, of course, because, you know, you've seen those everywhere. But pillow pets went and decided to make an official one. And well, since we have an official pillow pet, there's only one way to, you know, really test out if it actually works as a pillow. So let's use this Freddy pillow pet and try to take a nice sleepy nap time. Freddy Pillow Pet, what are you doing here? That's right, one of the first items I'm giving away is the Freddy Fazbear Pillow Pet because I have like three of these and I don't need three pillows. So if you guys would like to win the Freddy Fazbear Pillow Pet, real Puggle fans now have to enter in the completely free giveaway. But in case you don't, don't worry, I'll tell you guys at the end of the video. Rawr! So let's see what this next Forgotten FNAF merch is. And it feels kind of like a plushie. Shadow Freddy, I said you're not being in the video. Rawr! Get out of here, boy. <sighs> let's unbox these and see what other plushies we could have possibly forgotten. So, dumping out other Forgotten FNAF plush, wow, these are really mediocre. Let's go in size. So, the very first one we have is this little keychain dangler, Foxy, and well, this was forgotten because it's so lame. These were like $10 keychain dangers that are actually officially made by Funko. And well, maybe it's best they're forgotten because they're kind of ugly and they don't look super accurate as it, at all. Now, the next Forgotten FNAF merch we have is this super ugly Freddy Mymoji head. You might have seen the Mymojis in my other videos, but it's the figures. They thought this line was going to be so successful, they made plushies and figures for them. So, this plush, I do not want, so you guys can have it. This will be another one of the giveaway items because, well, frankly, it's garbage. And the next Forgotten piece of FNAF merch just came out recently, but it's so awful and trash, people have already forgotten it. This is the, um, the Five Nights at Freddy's hand puppet? Really? Yeah, it's, uh, and hello, hello, my name is Toy Freddy, and, uh, for some reason, they made Toy Freddy and Toy Bonnie hand puppets, not even any cool characters like Bon Bon and Bonnet, who are literally hand puppets, Toy Freddy and Toy Bonnie, yeah! So, uh, you really think I want this? You think I want this little guy? He cost me like 30 bucks. No, I'm gonna be giving him away too. Not as cool as the Freddy Pillow Pet, but it's still another free giveaway for you guys. Again, the real classic Puggle fans, you guys truly know how to enter in these free giveaways that I do every single video. And in case you're brand new around here, don't worry, I'll tell you guys at the end of this video. So let's go check out the next forgotten piece of Five Nights at Freddy's merchandise. Oof, what the lame FNAF plushies. Maybe those ones are best left forgotten. Let's see what next item we have up here. Uh, so opening it up, it FNAF pens? Are you serious? What? A Freddy pen, a Golden Freddy, a cupcake, a Chica, a Foxy? Well, what am I gonna do with these? I don't have a FNAF notebook to write in or anything. These are useless. Shadow Freddy, what I say about you being- Oh my goodness! A FNAF notebook! How perfect is this? Oh, Shadow Freddy, maybe I was wrong about you. Mwah. Oh yeah, Shadow Freddy. Oh, oh my goodness, Shadow Freddy, don't twerk in the video. Let's see if I can make any beautiful drawings with these pens. What? Shadow Freddy, is that the Giat of 87? What? <laughs> Just when I thought you were being good. Get this up. Ugh. What a garbage trying Shadow Freddy. Ugh. You're not an artist and you will never be. 
So, let's see the next forgotten piece of FNAF merch. Alright, Shadow Freddy, what FNAF item do we have up next? Let's see. We got... Whoa, is that the Five Nights at Freddy's movie on VHS tape? What? I don't think the movie ever even came out on this. It's such an old type of material. Oh my goodness, is this the official Five Nights at Freddy's movie? Yes, it is. It's a custom-made tape made by the super cool guy no, known as Valishard Tapes. Oh my, Shadow Freddy, let's have a nice little movie time. Let's go watch a movie together. Hooray, movie time! This place was huge in the 80s with the kids. It's been shut down for years. The only reason they haven't given it the old wrecking ball treatment is... Wow, Shadow Freddy, what a cute little movie date. So let's see the next item we have up. Hopefully it's something actually cool. Ugh. Let's open this up and see what we got inside. So, oh, the next Forgotten FNAF merch is Arctic Ballor because, in my opinion, this is the most forgotten Five Nights at Freddy's action figure ever made, and it's still in the box. I know there's other forgotten ones, such as recolors like Glow in the Dark Foxy and Glow in the Dark Baby, but I mean completely unique figures that have unique molds and designs and everything. I think Arctic Ballor is one of the most forgotten because it's such a lame character, honestly. I mean, sure, it has a cool design, but such a lame character and such a forgettable one. It was released at Walmart, and it wasn't released with any other figures. Frostbear's on the back of the box, but he was released like two years before her. I mean, not many people really care about about Arctic Ballora. So I bought another one just for this unboxing in box because I don't need two Arctic Ballora's. So again, the real Pugga fans know how to enter into this Arctic Ballora giveaway, but in case you don't, don't worry, I'll tell you guys how to win all the stuff at the end of this video. Now let's go check out what the next Forgone piece of FNAF merch is. Now the next piece of Forgone FNAF merch we have, oof, I have to treat this one lightly because it's kind of rare, are these completely forgone Five Nights at Freddy's two inch figures. This one's actually sealed in the box and you can tell that these figures were completely forgotten well simply because they are just tiny versions of the normal Funko, Funko action figures. For some reason Funko thought it would be a good idea to take their normal figures and make them really really tiny. So I will be giving them away not the ones in the box okay don't get greedy with me all right don't be greedy. We actually what? Shadow Freddy where are they get the items yeah. Here they are. Good job, Shadow Freddy. This is the second set of tiny little FNAF figures, and you can see that these are really just the normal action figures scaled down in a really cool endoskeleton, which I wish they made an action figure of, and they sadly never have. So, again, the real Pugga fans know how to enter to get these little guys, but no, you don't get the box. Don't ask for the box. This is mine, and it's special, and it's rare, and no, uh, I'm not gonna throw it. It's so rare. So, Shadow Freddy, let's see the next FNAF merch that's been completely forgotten, because how many of you guys honestly have these in your collection? As these came out all the way back in two 2016. And if you guys want a chance to be featured in a video, win exclusive giveaways, and even talk to me, join my Discord. The links to that are in the description. There's tons of other Pugga fans there you can meet. But Shadow Freddy, what time is it for Forgotten FNAF merch? It's ma 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 outfit time! Woo! So, I bought a ton of completely weird random FNAF outfit items that you guys probably had no idea existed. Like FNAF soda earrings. My ears aren't pierced, so I don't know how I'm gonna wear those. I don't wear earrings. We have a silly Bonnie hat, which is so ugly. Why would you wear this? We have a official Five Nights at Freddy's wearable Chica bib. Could you imagine seeing someone walking around wearing a Chica bib? We have super ugly Bonnie socks. Ew! Why do they look like this? I mean, at least they go along with the ugly Bonnie hat, but why would they make this? A Freddy Fazbear burger shirt? Seriously? A Freddy Fazbear burger? We're gonna wear all this merch, and then after we have a full-sized Freddy Fazbear FNAF costume. Not just the mask, but the whole thing. I will be suiting up like giant Freddy. I don't think Freddy Fazbear ever wore Nikes. Adid I don't think he ever wore shoes. When did they put Freddy? This is child-sized. I am large sized. So let's put these on and do a little Five Nights at Freddy's fashion show. Let's check it out. I truly might be the most handsome FNAF YouTuber ever, and I, you know, there's no really arguing that. And now it's time for the Freddy Fazbear full costume! Oh 
Open up, Freddy Fazbear. Let me wear your skin. <sighs> All right. Let's get suited up as Freddy Fat. Don't call me Weird Shadow Freddy. I'm going to look so handsome in this beautiful outfit. Let's get all suited up into beautiful. Mm, sexy Freddy Fazbear. Oh, yeah. Hello, it is me, the real. Freddy Fazbear. <laughs> I am Freddy Fazbear from the hit movie, The Five Nights at Freddy's Movie. <laughs> the next piece of Forgotten Five Nights at Freddy's merch that we have that you guys probably don't even really know exists is the official Five Nights at Freddy's YouTube's gummies. Now, the really only the way to buy these is they released a gummy subscription. Which, honestly, I think is really strange, and I got enough of these to give away to you guys, and I can actually ship these guys out to you. So, I'm going to eat one for myself, and for the rest of the giveaway, you guys can win three FNAF U2's gummies. Real Puggle fans know how to enter it, but come on, we have to do a little taste test of these yummy nummy U2's gummies. So, let's rip into these Five Nights at Freddy's U2's gummies. Wow, let's see how healthy they are. Oh my goodness, wow, so healthy gummies. I love when gummies are healthy, and they taste a little funky. Let's see if these Freddy Fazbear gummies are really going to mess me up bad. Ooh, how, what do they look like in there? Ooh, wow. So ooey gooey yummy. So there's a Freddy gummy and a Vanny gummy. And it looks like the Freddy is peach flavor and the Vanny is a strawberry flavor. And these are, are from YouTube. My good buddies, YouTube. You guys, you guys love the YouTubes on my channel. So, oh, they are very sticky. Wow, look at the Vanny. How pretty is that? Look at Vanny. All right. Mm, they're pretty good. It has a little sugar on it, kind of like a Sour Patch Kid, but it's not sour. And it's definitely strawberry flavored. I like that. Mm. What about Freddy? Whoa, that looks like Freddy Fazbear. Hur, 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 hur. Um. Mm. That's pretty good. I really like that. Mm. Mm. I'm going to eat the rest of those later. But if you guys would like to win the other three packs of these in the giveaway, real plug fans know how to enter in the giveaway. That's pretty good. These shouldn't be too forgotten. They sell these on their website, but they're kind of hard to buy. Is It's like a gummy subscription, you know? They're all molded into one big gummy in there. Or I think they sold these at FYE. These don't deserve to be forgotten and not really merch you guys didn't know about. Hopefully you know now because those are pretty good. I pretty like those. So let's go check out the next FNAF merch and there's a ton more food. So let's go find it. So let's check out the next little piece of FNAF merch that you- Shadow Friday said you're not in the video. Let's check out the next little piece of FNAF merch that you guys probably don't remember. The next FNAF merch we have is... Oh, great. The Icky Icky... FNAF candy dispensers. I mean, look at these. How many of you guys honestly own these or even remember they exist because I don't because they're disgusting? Ew. They are meant to hold little... Oh, what's inside? Little ASMR for you guys. Wow, Freddy Fazbear ASMR. What's inside of Freddy Fazbear? Uh, oh, looks like we have some fun little FNAF candies. Mmm. Let's try some of these candy. Yeah. Ugh, oh my oh it spilled ever oh that's disgusting ill Freddy Fazbear you're going to poison me with your icky yucky candy does this even look like Freddy Fazbear look at this ill all right I'm throwing this guy into the street I don't even care fly high yucky gross Freddy Fazbear see you later Ugh. Oh man, what icky little candy dispenser, Shadow Freddy. But you got me a special gift? Let's see. Oh my goodness, this is a massive box. FNAF drink experience. Ooh, looks like we might be in a treat for a little FNAF soda review. Let's find out what's inside. So let's take a look at what special FNAF drinks we have in here. Oh my goodness, this really is the FNAF drink experience. Let's just take out all this FNAF, uh, obscure FNAF merch and see what it is. So it looks like we have some special soda cups. We have a special Mangle Diner soda cup and a special Toy Freddy soda cup. Looks like we also have the sodas to go along with them. Looks like we have a Glamrock Freddy soda for the Freddy cup and a Roxanne Wolf soda for the Mangle cup. Now, most of these are unknown because these are actually only exclusive to FYE. That's the only store you can get them at. That's the only store you can get the special limited edition 
fizzy fast FNAF soda, as well as these limited edition super cool FNAF cups. But that's not all we have in here. Looks like we also have a super special exotic beverage cup, which is so cool, just like FNAF VR, which I'd say is really unknown. Hot Topic dropped this out of nowhere for about only a week, and then it just disappeared forever. And one of them, which is a little more known, but I had to include because you guys kept suggesting for me to review the FNAF mugs, even though I already have a ton, is this super special Freddy Fazbear U2's mug. So let's do an ultimate little FNAF drink review test, huh? Super gross FNAF soda almost made me sick. You taste like toilet water. Blech. Disgusting. Get out of here. Nasty gross FNAF soda. That's where you belong. Never drink the FNAF soda. It hurts your belly. <laughs> Absolutely disgusting FNAF soda. You're already in the trash where you belong. But you know what else you deserve? To be smashed by Mr. Hammer. Oh, I hate gross yucky FNAF soda because it hurt my belly. <clears throat> Yeah, you get what you deserve. So now we are taking a look at the very final Forgotten Five Nights at Freddy's merch that you guys probably don't remember or you completely forgot about. So Mr. Hammer, would you do the honors and help me unbox the final piece of Five Nights at Freddy's merch? Oh yes, I'm Mr. Hammer and we'll help you. Oh, thank you, Mr. Hammer. <coughs> 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 <sighs> Inside here, the most forgotten piece of an app that you don't remember is, oh my goodness, the Five Nights at Freddy's inflatable Freddy Fazbear. What, what the heck? Shut up, Freddy. What are you saying? Well, yeah, of course I use him in like every video because no one else has this inflatable Freddy Fazbear. I'm like the only person to own one. Wait, you really want me to use something else? Something even rarer than this? How would I do that? What other forgotten super rare FNAF words could there possibly be? What? What do you mean you put a special new item in the box? Whoa! Shadow Freddy resealed it. It's me. Oh my goodness, what could possibly be in here? But before we do that, here's the giveaway of everything we are giving away at the end of this video to like a bunch of you lucky winners. So you made it this far, let me tell you how to enter in this giveaway completely for free. Real Puggle fans know how to do the steps, but in case you don't, all you gotta do is like the video, subscribe to this channel, and leave a comment saying you finished all three steps and what your favorite part of the video was. Some people just say they finished all three steps, but I wanna know what your favorite part of the video is so I know it's funny. But I think it's time we open up this super special package from Shadow Freddy. It's gotta be something that no one knows about. Some FNAF words possibly so forgotten that maybe I'm the only person in the entire world to- <gasps> Oh my goodness. Is that who I think it is? The sexy, sexy candy cadet. Not only that, but this is the only candy cadet plushie in the entire world. Of course, there's the Funko Candy Cadet plush, but this Candy Cadet is so special from good stuff. It is the only ever Candy Cadet prototype two foot tall good stuff plush. Look how big he is compared to Shadow Freddy. He's so big, a massive Candy Cadet good stuff plushie that I know absolutely none of you guys have because, well, this is the only one ever made. You can see as a special prototype good stuff tag. Oh my goodness, would you look at this? No one else has him. This guy was extremely expensive, and I will be featuring him in other videos just because of how cool he is. I even bought some super special other FNAF prototypes that I will show you guys in a later video. But I think for the final piece of FNAF merch, this Candy Cadet is absolutely incredible. So I really hope you guys did enjoy this video. Don't forget to enter into the giveaway for all this stuff, and I will see you all later. Good.